Hey everybody, welcome back to the Joe Rockstar channel. Good news for Joe Rockstar fans, I'm still alive. Yes, 18 months have passed since my last cancer treatment and my latest scans came up clear. So as we rush towards New Year's Day, I thought this would be the perfect time to celebrate the past year and beyond, all the way back to May 2015 and the start of my adventure in dirt bike riding. Well, it didn't get off to a great start. Not knowing anything about dirt bikes, I bought an underpowered and heavy 2014 Honda CRF 250L. A bike ill-suited for serious off-road use, I found myself outgrowing it quickly. So how would I respond? Overkill, that's how. All right, we're at Go AZ Motorcycles in Scottsdale, Arizona, where uh, we're about to pick up my new bike. So let's do this. There she is. Only three months later, I was throwing my leg over what could arguably be the worst choice of bike for a beginner a 2016 KTM 500 EXC. Now lately, I have had my reservations about this bike, but don't get me wrong. If I was not racing in tight single track, there's no other bike I would rather be on. This bike has been a dream to learn on. Sure, I've had my struggles to say the least. But despite the naysayers and YouTube experts' warnings, I have managed not only to learn to ride on this bike, but to race it. And I've done so without any serious injury or breaking the bike. Maybe that's a testament to how fast I learn, but I doubt it. It's more likely that anyone with some self-control and respect for the bike can learn on such a beast. And oh, the places it has taken me. Is this not beautiful? Is this not beautiful? From trails and tracks, up hills, through valleys, to the top of the world. And now, into another world. A world I thought was for other people. Racing. And it's more than just the actual miles ridden. It has given me my health back. I've lost over 60 pounds and have gotten stronger. My endurance has increased significantly. And let's face it, riding a dirt bike probably raised my testosterone levels a little. I am so thankful for the time I have. Some do not get a second chance, and I know this. I want to acknowledge each and every person who has been affected by cancer. I want to offer my condolences to those who have lost someone, and for those who are suffering now, I wish you the best in your battle. For those of us who are still here, survivors, or anyone who has the opportunity to live free of illness, I urge you to find your own dirt bike adventure. If not literally, then find your equivalent. <laughs> 